We have a trunk over here. 18 inch tires, all display. And the 55 kilowatt hour battery. You have sneak AC vents right over here. Tata has launched the much anticipated Coupe SUV, the Curve EV right here in the flesh and it can be had in two battery power options, a 45 kilowatt hour battery and a 55 kilowatt hour battery. Let's see what all details are there, what's it good about, a pack of features, ADAS level and everything. Here's the video. To start with the exteriors, this is how the front of the car looks like and speaking about the front, we have a frunk over here. So this is around 5 kgs of maximum payload or 11 litres. And this is what the front looks like. Now we're gonna try and close it. Now that being done, this is how the LED light bar uh, looks on the new Tata Curve EV. And you can see the same design language uh, on the Nexon and the Punch as well. This is where the charging port goes in and you have small air curtains for the aero efficiency of the vehicle. You have LED headlamps over here. Again, the grill has been done like this. Uh, for the EV, you can see the sensor over here and there's a camera over here again for the ADAS functionalities. Moving on to the bonnet of the car, you have small creases over here which adds to the sporty look of the car. It looks beautiful and now here we have body cladding uh, and the tyres. It's 18 inch tyres, all this space with aero inserts because it's an EV. Take a look at that, it looks beautiful. And here we have the EV badging, the, the indicators over here. Uh, which is on the ORVM which has been treated in black. The entire glass house, uh, the width of the car basically, from the A pillar to the C pillar, it has been done in black. Uh, one could have asked for uh, chrome elements. Let me know in the comments below if uh, you would have liked chrome elements over here, but there is piano black finish over here and then matte, matte black finish over here. And you have a strong shoulder line over here, which runs the width of car and uh, kind of dissolves over here. It is not to be seen after this place and you have plush two handles again with the, uh, going with the aero efficiency and aero uh, style of the car. Uh, you have a blind detection spot mirror over here. It shows right there and you have the body cladding again uh, done in piano black uh, treatment. At the rear of the car, yes, this is the space that has that will be talked about the most. So again, a spoiler kind of looking thing. It's integrated a shark fin antenna right there and these are defogger lines so this is how the rear of the car looks like with a strong line over here and again a light bar which runs coast to coast here's the camera and uh, the party trick of the tata curve ev is a uh, tailgate functionality where if you swipe the leg right like this it is supposed to open it's not opening right now so you have uh, sensors over here and this is how the exterior of the Tata curve looks like and now we will go inside and see what the interiors have to offer. The door panel has been done in piano black finish with silver accents, looks quite nice. We have the JBL audio tweeters right over here, the JBL sound system tweeters right over here and uh, you could have had a small space over here to keep your knickknacks, your magazines but uh, that is not there. You can see some nice stitching over here, it looks nice three-point seat belts for all the three passengers. We have a movable armrest which also has uh, cup holders. You have two AC vents over here and a C-type charging outlet over there. And we have all white interiors with a gray finish which is which can attract a lot of dust but then again it's, it's an upkeep. And you have some space over here for a bag or two and then you have isofix child mount seats. Uh, and uh, of course the massive panoramic sunroof and uh, that's the second row experience of the Tata Curve. Let's head to the first row. Now let's talk about what is offered as powertrain when it comes to the Tata Curve EV. To start with you can have with two battery packs. One is a 45 kilowatt hour battery and one is a 55 kilowatt hour battery. The 45 kilowatt hour battery has claimed a range of 330 to 350 kilometers on a single full charge and the 55 kilowatt hour battery uh, that gives a range of 420 to 450 kilometers estimated. Now this one the, uh, the company claims a 0 to 100 km per hour dash in just 8.6 seconds and uh, right now the dash shows 343 kilometers of range. Now that's the powertrain information of the Tata Curve EV. 
what do you think about the range what do you think about the speed also the top speed is logged at 160 km per hour now if you look at the center console or the center part of the car you have sleek ac vents right over here with a silver panel right over here it looks quite upmarket you have a nice stitching over here this entire finish has been done in white uh, probably because of the lighting it looks a little gray and now here we have the ac hvac controls you have tactable button for the fan and uh, temperature control which is nice the rest of them it is uh, a touch screen control and here we have the power uh, electric gear shifter you have the uh, usb cable over here and a usb a charging port over here and uh, a c type c type charger over here and you have another 12 watt outlet over here and uh, here we have the wireless wireless charger uh, for your phones and uh, it looks quite cool that is how the interior of the first row looks like the tata curve ev now this is the tata curve ice version and as you can see the exteriors are still the same uh, not much of a difference the air curtains are over there as you can see i can show you the panel gap and here you have the grill again and uh, the camera right over there here's the camera and uh, the sensors right over here and here is the led light bar uh, that runs from coast to coast which also shows you uh, the new design tata design language which has been seen in the punch as well as on the nexon let me know in the comments below what do you think about it and here we have the led headlamps and the tata logo right here and uh, in the ev version we have the charging port right over here but here we have just the logo as you can see there's a there's a slight haunch right over here and you have some lines over here that show the sporty the sporty look of the car and again you have 18 inch alloys uh, and you have right now it's run on uh, Goodyear tires with disc brake right here let's see and usually you will have the EV badging over here you have the curb you have flush door handles over here as you can see people are shooting again all disc brakes now when it comes to the interiors of the Tata Curve Ice, now there is not much of a difference. Again, you get you get the digital dash right over there. You get the 10 inch uh, infotainment unit right over there with Android Auto, Apple CarPlay. You have a manual gearbox right over here. And again, the entire console remains the same, but uh, the upholstery colors and the interior colors have been changed. So you have gray texture over here. And uh, then this is done in burgundy color which looks quite nice you let me know in the comments below what do you think about this color because it has been done everywhere even on the steering wheel uh, the indoor panels of the door and uh, the seat overall if you uh, open up the uh, sunroof as well it might look nice it would you know reflect off the uh, burgundy color and you know might light up the cabin let me know in the comments below what do you think about this new color scheme being offered with the tata curve ice version now this is the tata cup ice but why i'm shooting this is because i'm trying to showcase accessories that are genuine from tata motors that you can add on so to start with you have this nice inverted l-shaped uh, covering for the uh, led headlamp setup and you have small badging of curve that can be placed over here and this skid plate this is also uh, an accessory and apart from that if you move here you can see that uh, there is a cone strip over here that's also a part of the accessory and you can have these installed as well on your car there's also a genuine accessory and uh, as we move further behind this is also a part of the accessory you can stick this onto the car which adds to the most sporty look of the car again the chrome plated boomerang uh, panel over here again an accessory and apart from that this cycle can be fitted right over here and that is also a part of the accessory console that you get and if I take a look at here, so this is an entire showcase of accessories that you can add to your new Tata Curve EV as well as ICE. So there's a music system and there, is, there are these new alloy wheels. There's a refrigerator that comes from Tata itself. You let me know in the comments below which one did you like the most essentially both are on the same platform so there is not much of a difference apart from a few specs here and there and follow park plus for all the content subscribe to the channel click the bell icon to stay updated to all the videos that we do i'll see you on the next one